YouTube, this is Linda. Listen, I just did a video about concrete poisoning. I never showed you the shed that I was working on. Uh, so I wanted to take time to show you. This is uh, going to be an above ground uh, food storage shed. It's made out of hay bales, exactly 20. And um, it has a lean-to roof, which will be insulated. Um, the outside is encased in um, a mixture of Portland cement, um, uh, dirt, just regular earth, and um, sand, and um, then it's covered entirely in this so that um, the straw stays nice and dry. Um, let me see if I can find the other picture here. Anyway, and this is what it looks like. He, this is my son putting on um, the the roof. Um, now we have the roof enclosed, and it's going to be insulated uh, with a high R insulation. And then the door will also be insulated. Uh, it's kind of like an above ground root cellar, so that it stays uh, constant temperature, and and we can store our food storage in it. Anyway, I uh, just wanted to bring you that real quickly and, and tell you, oh, by the way, this is a really, really inexpensive way to make a root cellar. This took 20 bales of hay. Um, it's tall enough to stand up in it. It doesn't look like it from here, but when you get inside, you probably have two or three inches above your head. Um, and um, and that's for somebody who's, who's 5'10", because um, my son can stand in it reasonably. Anyway, um, so it took 20 bales of, of hay or straw and uh, it's set on a foundation of cinder blocks and um, um, it's a load bearing roof. So you don't, the only thing that's framed is the door um, and then the, the roof sits down over it like a cap. Um, he built it that way and then it's got some cross beams that go across. But anyway, um, a very inexpensive way to build. Um, it's so far, you know, with we, we've gotten all of the outside walls um, covered now in, in this substance, and it's taken two bags of Portland cement, and um, we made it a little thicker. So anyway, just, just an idea of, of a way to put up a, a very inexpensive shed. The total has cost us less than $100. So... Um, and we put about, I don't know, eight hours of work, ten hours of work max into it, and it's almost completed. So um, just thought you might like this little idea. Um, Yahweh bless.